Good morning, Viber Hurley. Welcome to Minutes with Melum on this beautiful Thursday, May 21st. Uh, coming to you today from the city park in Hurley. And looks to be a gloomy <clears throat> start to the day today. Uh, birds are chirping in the background. I do not see any sunshine yet, so let's cross our fingers and hope we see some of that today. Uh, announcements. We have check-in days for students' materials today and tomorrow in both buildings from 8 to 12.30 and 4 to 7. So please check in all student materials that were checked out and pay any undue unpaid lunch balances as well as pick up any student medication or other materials that needs to be picked up from the buildings before we can start summer vacation. Also, please see the school website or Facebook page for an 8th grade recognition video. Uh, help us honor and recognize our 8th graders as they move from middle school to high school. You will also notice in the next few days an athletic banquet video that will be coming out. The athletic videos will be put out there uh, in the next day or two, and that is to replace our normal in-person athletic banquet that we usually have in the district. No birthdays in the Viber Curley School District today, so no birthdays, but we do have some from July coming up, so we're going to go through the July birthdays. Uh, bear with me as I go through this list. It's got a little breeze out here today, so I'm going to try to read through it and not uh, fumble the paper around because of the breeze. So we're going to start in elementary. We have James Jensen on the 2nd of July, Phoenix Matsko on the 5th of July, and Astro Dell on the 7th. Continuing on, if Mr. Mellum can turn a page. Next in the elementary, we have Kinsley Knutson on the, the 1st of July, Peyton Wordle on the 6th, Riley Boozman on the 10th, Turner Van Hall on the 17th, Kaisley Knutson on the 18th, Landry Peterson on the 18th, Kayla Schoolmeister on the 20th, Wally Rice on the 24th, and Isabel Walton on the 24th. As well as, I believe we have one more elementary in there. As well as Olivia Shep on the 26th. Middle school, and I'm going to apologize to one of my middle, middle schoolers, Tanner Ashelman. I missed your birthday yesterday in June. Tanner Ashelman's birthday is June 13th. Um, Evan Campbell on July 5th. Daniel Padilla on July 5th. Caden Walton on July 8th. Olivia Hansen on July 10th. Lexi Wettering on July 17th. Ava Marie Wood on July 19th. Zach Miller on the 19th. Lyric Donahue on the 23rd. Addison Seiler on the 25th. And Madeline Fayok on the, oh geez. Hold on, let me get it here. Madeline's birthday is on the 25th as well. High school birthdays. We have Colin Graves on the 4th, Ty Van Hull on the 11th, Mateus Kessler on the 20th, and Calvin Rasmussen on the 23rd of July. So those are our birthdays for the Viber Hurley School District in July. Uh, let's see, why am I filming from the park today? Well, we do have Memorial Day coming up. Uh, some of us think of Memorial Day as the official start of summer, which it kind of technically is, and the, you know, celebration of camping and being outdoors and all that good stuff. Well, the main purpose um, of Memorial Day is to honor all of our military veterans who have died while in service to their country, particularly those who have died in battle or as a result of wounds sustained in battle. Okay, Memorial Day is celebrated on the last Monday of May. All right. We spend time during Memorial Day remembering those who have lost their lives and could not come home, reflecting on their service and why we have the luxuries and freedoms we enjoy today. So, the difference between Memorial Day and Veterans Day, on Veterans Day, which is November 11th, and we celebrate that while we are in school with Veterans Day programs, that day is set aside to, is to thank all and honor all who have served in wartime or in peacetime, regardless of whether they died or survived. So Memorial Day is remembering those who have fallen while in battle or as a result of wounds sustained in battle. And Veterans Day is to honor all military um, living and dead and who have served in war or in peacetime. So those are the big differences there. And a couple facts about Memorial Day. Uh, let's see, no less than 25 places in the United States have been named in connection with the origin of Memorial Day. And before the actual start of Memorial Day, when it became a national holiday, states observed the holiday on different dates throughout the year. So in 1971, the United States Congress made Memorial Day a national holiday. So that started all back in 1971. 
So from everyone here at the Viber Hurley School District, we would like to say thank you to those men and women who paid the ultimate price. We will always remember your sacrifices of our nation's heroes. We are deeply grateful. In remembering the fallen, we also honor their loved ones, spouses, fathers, mothers, sons, daughters, sisters, brothers, and friends. There really aren't proper words, but we do live in gratitude each and every day for the precious gift that you have all given us. So from the Fiber Curly School District, please remember Memorial Day, honor those who have fallen and paid the ultimate price for us to live in the freedoms we have today. That's all for Mr. Mellum. I will be with you tomorrow for my last filming of the school year. So until then, stay safe, stay warm, enjoy the day, and we'll see you soon.